Welcome to State Attack. Let's take a look at purchasing apps or movies or even music from the iTunes or app stores on your iPhone 10. Now the first thing we want to do is make sure that we have Face ID enabled to allow purchases on our device. So we're going to hop into settings, we're going to swipe down until we see Face ID and passcode, tap on that and then enter in your passcode to get into here. If you've never set this up, what you'll want to do is actually enable a passcode. You can choose either a six digit passcode or an alphanumeric password to choose as that. And then we can set up Face ID, which we have a video on setting up Face ID as well. So I'm going to go enter in my passcode and then we'll move on to the next step. So now that we're in here, you can see that I can use Face ID for unlock, Apple Pay, iTunes and App Store, Safari Autofill, and then I even have other apps that third party developers have integrated with Face ID. The one that we're worried about is iTunes and App Store. If that is not on, make sure and tick that on. It's going to ask you to fill in your Apple ID password. That way you can remember it and then from there on you'll be able to use Face ID to purchase your apps. So now once you're ready to purchase an app or even a movie or music from the iTunes or App Store, come in here. And so here's an application that I'm going to go ahead and purchase. We'll tap on get. This one happens to be free, but if it was a paid app, you'd see a price there. And then you're going to go ahead and tap on that and then we're going to purchase it. Notice here with this one, it wants to use Face ID. So we're going to have to double click on our side button to install the application. Down below at the bottom of the screen, we see the App Store. We're seeing the app name, a nice icon, the developer. This one happens to offer in-app purchases, so we can see that. Otherwise, we would see the price where it says offer in-app purchases, and then we can see the account that we're purchasing it for, and then we're gonna confirm with the side button. So go ahead and double click on that, and it's gonna scan our face, so we can see that Face ID has gone through and done, and now it's gonna come back and it's gonna begin installing the application, or downloading the music, or video, or whatever we happen to have purchased. In this case, since we downloaded an app, it's gonna add it out to the home screen, and there is the app that we just purchased. So that is how you download and install and purchase applications, movies, and music on your iPhone 10 from the iTunes and App Stores. If you found this video useful, be sure and give it a thumbs up. For more videos like this, be sure and subscribe to State of Tech, and we'll see you in the next one.